The idea behind the exhibit uh, was to look at how quilts are expressive of women's experiences in the West. So it's not a traditional quilt exhibit in the sense that the quilts themselves are the focus. It's not about the artistry of the quilts. It's not about, you know, quilting as an art form or, you know, 30 of the, the best contemporary art quilts or 30 really incredible Oregon Trail quilts or, you know, something like that. It's really about the stories behind them and the women who made them. Um, we, you know, had been talking about how, um, as an institution, we'd never really done an exhibit that looked specifically at women in the West. Um, and this was an, uh, an opportunity to do that. Of course, uh, 2020 is the 100th anniversary of the passage of the 19th Amendment. Um, so kind of doing this exhibit this year made sense. <laughs> um, and uh, one thing we really wanted to do with this exhibit was to really look at how um, how diverse the experiences of women in the West are um, and how uh, diverse they've been through time um, and how quilts are, are such a great illustration of that. Um, so the, the quilts you'll see throughout the exhibit um, range from the 1840s to the present, really wide time range. There's about 30 of them in the show. Um, really uh, fascinating, you know, examples of, of different techniques and all of that. I mean, of course, in the end, we still wanted them to be beautiful quilts, you know, quality uh, examples of quilting. But ultimately, the, the selection process for the quilts started with the stories behind them.